Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Bridgewater Raritan is brought to you by Princeton Orthopedic Associates. I'm Jay Cook with JerseySportsZone.com here in Somerset County for a big time public school lacrosse showdown. This is one of the top games this week. Bridgewater Raritan hosts Bernards as two public school teams on the rise go to war. The Panthers have run this county in recent years. The Mountaineers look to take that mantle. Dane Costas wins the opening faceoff for BR, and he's the one who strikes first. The Boston commit fires in a fastball, and that gives the Panthers an early 1-0 edge. BR played great defense in the first quarter. Cameron Cordilla makes a stop here. That 1-0 lead is still intact after one. After an atypical scoreless quarter, Bernards comes to life in the second. Logan Stevens gives the Mountaineers a big jolt. He scores back-to-back -back goals to make it a 2-1 game. Constant pressure helps Bernards tack on another. Charlie Hunwell twists and scores. The Mountaineers have a two-goal lead. Logan Stevens was a man on fire in the second. Here's the hat trick. It's his third goal in a three and a half minute span. Bernards extends their lead to 4-2. The Panthers are the ones who go into the half with momentum, however. Andrew Childs hammers one off the cage and in. At the halftime break, Bridgewater Raritan trails 4-3. Bernard's go-to man this season has been David Brothers. He had no goals in the first half. That changes in the second half. Brothers gets all sorts of charged up after a big goal here in the third. Not one, but two goals for the senior Wagner commit in a short span. They come two minutes apart. The Mountaineers build up a 6-4 advantage. Everything is working for Bernards in the third quarter. Caden cursed having a great day in the cage. Here's one of 14 saves for the future Rutgers Scarlet Knight. And the offense just kept on rolling. Charlie Hunwell connects on a leaping goal. That makes it a 7-4 game with just 12 seconds left in the third quarter. But they're not done. Bernards wins the ensuing faceoff. They race down the field. Logan Stevens shoots. He beats the buzzer. Oh, what a shot. All the momentum belongs to the Mountaineers and Logan Stevens, who has his fourth goal. Bernards steals one at the horn, and they go into the fourth quarter with a commanding 8-4 advantage. Bridgewater would try to close the gap in the fourth with a goal from Aiden West that trickles in, but Bernards is the one standing at the end. Logan Stevens buries his fifth goal of the game to put the finishing touch on a huge win for Bernards. 9-5 is the final. It's the Mountaineers' first win over the Panthers since the 2021 season. A five-goal day from Logan Stevens and a five-point day from David Brothers helped deliver the victory. Um, you know, we kind of embraced the challenge. We tried to take as many opportunities as we could and took all the chances we got, and we sunk a bunch and led us us winning the game. Oh, we felt right at home. Maybe maybe in the beginning, but then about, oh, the boys are going crazy. We're still feeling it. Yeah, uh, yeah again... Uh, we, we were really excited for this one. We're never really scared of anybody. We, we're usually the bad guy, and that's uh, the kind of mantle we're going to be running this season. Yeah. You guys feeling good, though? Oh, we're feeling great. We're going to party. Reporting from Bridgewater, I'm Jay Cook, JerseySportsZone.com.